we have an impact weather day ahead <clears throat> for Wednesday. Our next round of rain arriving later tonight and through the bulk of the day tomorrow. So really the window for the metro between midnight and three o'clock with the bulk of the rain likely falling during the morning drive tomorrow. So a quarter of an inch to three quarters of an inch uh, possible really around the metro and east. And there could be some spots that pick up uh, maybe an inch of rain or slightly more in parts of southwest. I'll show you here this model projection starting at midnight tonight. So before midnight, we're likely dry. Rain chances go up late tonight. This has that swath of heaviest rain really along the river and east, giving uh, parts of the metro you know, almost close to a half an inch of rain by the end of the morning drive tomorrow, but a little uh, or quite less just off to the west. And then by the end of the day, you'd see half an inch to an inch possible. Most of southwest Iowa, northwest Missouri, and maybe right along the river in Nebraska and then less as you go west. Today, don't have to worry about any wet weather. Really hard to find some clouds today. Look at the flag blowing. That's our view from the Embassy Suites in La Vista. It's 52 degrees here at the lunch hour. 52 is the normal high temperature. For Omaha this time in November, sunny skies, but look at that wind 20 miles per hour out of the southeast windbreaker weather this afternoon. Almost everybody in the 50s except for Carol at 48, but 55 and Lincoln 57 in Beatrice. There's the wind 15 to 20 miles per hour. We're seeing those gusts close to 30 miles per hour right now, and that's really where there's will they'll stay not only through the rest of the day, but overnight. So that southeast breeze going to persist into the nighttime hours and keep temperatures from really dropping off a whole lot overnight tonight. So most high temperatures mid to upper 50s, especially around and south of the metro area, are likely hitting in the 60s down in Beatrice, maybe Fall City, Lincoln as well. Here's the breakdown of the 12 hour forecast. We'll peak 3, 4 o'clock, mid to upper 50s. Still fairly comfortable, though still breezy in the evening. And then after midnight, we'll see those impact icons in as the rain chances increase. System right now over the Rockies heading eastward. So enjoying the sunshine while we have it right now because we'll cloud back over here later on this evening. You see mid to upper 50s near 60 by 4 o'clock. Here come the clouds midnight. Maybe a few spotty showers, but as we get closer to drive time tomorrow, especially this uh, latest model run showing quite a bit of uh, widespread heavier rain, maybe a rumble of thunder within this, but that would bring some soaking rain for the morning drive. Continues to push east, but still some more lingering showers in the afternoon, mainly around the metro and into southwest Iowa. So rain shutting down earlier, likely west of the metro and then later in the evening off to the east, but the clouds going to stay put. So don't count on any sunshine tomorrow and temperatures are really going to stay in the 40s and low 50s most of the day. So a little dip in temperature Wednesday, but then we get the sunshine back upper 50s Thursday and look at this nice little warm up 60s into the weekend before we cool down Sunday and then more rain chances into early next week.